So when we collaborate and cooperate, um, it becomes a much more powerful learning tool. So today we've run a simulation exercise to enable our students to experience a, a real world situation, in this case a house fire, and practice so that they um, have some understanding of how to work with other agencies like the fire service, um, the police, and their ambulance colleagues when they go out into practice education and when they graduate and become paramedics. Uh, today we've had the fire service uh, go in um, into that smoky environment that we've created and rescue all of our mannequins and bring them out for our paramedic students to treat. Simulations are a really great way to get hands on in realistic scenarios. We got to work with fire service and the police service so it was really good to work with different agencies because that is what we'd be dealing with in a real life scenario, getting hands on, using iSimulate and having to use actual equipment to treat these patients. Um, it helps students to understand what real casualties are actually like so that if a real incident should come along we all know how to work together and where each other's roles are and where we'd be at that time. The takeaway was definitely how to work with the different agencies, the police and the fire, knowing what their role was and what they expected from us was really useful. It's really important from my perspective to make sure that uh, graduating paramedics understand the relationship between uh, what they do and the other services. So uh, there's a number of lessons to be learned in cooperating with, um, with police and with fire service and understanding uh, what those services do and how we can all effectively work together uh, to prevent harm and uh, basically to save lives. At first I was really nervous, we've not done it before, it was our first one, but then I think when you get out there and you start seeing everything going on, you find almost calm in the chaos because you know you've got a job to do and then from that point on it's getting your head down and treating patients.